The Cascadia study will examine the spread of COVID-19 and how well vaccines work over the course of five years. We hope that we can answer some important questions, particularly in the younger kids, about um, how well does the vaccine protect? How long does the protection last? Um, what does it look like when you get a breakthrough infection, when you've been vaccinated and boosted and boosted again? 3,500 children and adults as young as six months and up to 49 years of age living near Portland or Seattle will be recruited for the study. The three things that you need to complete as part of this study are questionnaires, weekly nose swabs, and annual blood draws. So it's free weekly testing for coronavirus that you are getting um, as part of the study. So that's an advantage, especially, you know, we all have antigen kits. As soon as you have one positive in your household, you're basically out of those antigen tests almost immediately because you have to test every single person basically every other day. And so it's a nice way to get weekly testing um, and to provide reassurance to your family that you have no coronavirus in your household. The fact that it's five years long gives us a lot of opportunity to understand a lot of things as they come up. So, for example, there will be lots of new vaccines that will come out, and those will probably be licensed over the course of the next five years. There will probably be combination vaccines. Um, we will see people's immunity change over time as they get exposed to viruses again. We may see new pathogens arrive in Seattle and in Portland, um, and we can use these samples and these data to really understand how we respond to these new pathogens, how our immune system evolves.